Happy 5782, everybody. Hope each and every one of you had a wonderful and inspiring Rosh Hashanah. And I want to wish each and every one of you a Gemara Chasim Matoeva. Should be sealed for a good and happy year. And I want to encourage you to tell your friends and family members to join our Halacha Day. What a great time. New year, new opportunity to take on something new, especially now. Just share the link and let them join aboard the Halacha Day train. So here we go. We're talking about tefillin. And we said how you're supposed to put on the arm tefillin and the head tefillin. We also said you're not supposed to interrupt um, after you make the blessing for nothing, right? Don't interrupt. And if you do interrupt, then you got to say the, you have to say the blessing again. But here's what he's about to tell you. If by error you interrupted, move the shell yad a bit and repeat the blessing, laniach tefillin. So in other words, don't just repeat it. You got to first move it around a little bit and then repeat the blessing. And tighten the knot, right? Tighten it, then we're going to wrap seven times. After that, put on the show Rosh and recite the blessing, right? Al mitzvah's tefillin on the Rosh, on the head tefillin. If the interruption was necessary to the mitzvah of tefillin, you are not required to repeat the blessing over the show Yad. So in other words, let's say you say to someone, hey, am I doing this right? So that would be okay, that interruption. You weren't supposed to do that in between the blessings, but because it was relevant to the tefillin, you don't have to repeat the blessing. But ideally, as we mentioned, you make the blessing on the, the arm tefillin, then you tighten it, and then you wrap, and don't interrupt until you make the blessing on the head tefillin, arm tefillin, then say, and never interrupt. But again, if you do interrupt, only if it was relevant, you don't have to repeat it. If it was not relevant, move it a little bit, then repeat the blessing. That was Lacha 551. Thanks for listening. To sponsor future Lacha. $36, 100 for the gold. Remember, tshuva, repentance, tefila, prayer, utzdaka, charity, mavir, nezra, gazeira. Remove the evil decree. So now would be a great time to help sponsor. Thanks for listening. We'll see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful day.